Hi, this is Dr. Touch. Today I want to demonstrate a new app I made in a single day. Um, it's one of these things that I just had to make to get out of my system so that I can concentrate on something useful. Uh, I love to watch those TED Talks and here's one uh, where Bill Gates speaks on zero energy. And one thing that all these talks have in common is that they have this speaker clock uh, that shows the speakers how long uh, they have spoken and how much time is left. And there's also this kind of uh, traffic light that tells them when uh, to wrap up their speech. Now, I figured I wanted to do something like that myself, especially because I'd created the DT LED uh, number view. And that would be a, a good uh, thing to use for that. So I present speaker clock. When you open it the first time, it's set up for 18 uh, minutes because that's exactly the duration that all T TED TED speakers are getting. Uh, and uh, basically, if you just tap it once, it starts counting down. It's very nice big uh, letters that you can see from 10 or 20 meters away without a problem. Uh, if you tap it again, it stops. If you tap and uh, drag, you can set it. If you double tap, uh, you set it to the preset. And also you can uh, tap the preset button uh, to get to the preset amount. Um, if you want to set it to another um, uh, duration, uh, you just drag it there and then you tap and hold um, the button and you see it lights up. And every time the, the duration is the same as the um, preset, it lights up. Now you have this uh, traffic light here. Basically green means you have enough time for everything. Uh, if you get below uh, three minutes, which is the standard setting, um, it starts to go to yellow. And if you go further down, it goes to red. For yellow, you know, aha, you have to draw some final conclusions. And in red, you have to wrap up your speech. And if you don't like uh, these these amounts, um, these, these durations, you can set them. For example, if you wanted, say, um, four minutes to be the yellow one, you just tap and hold this. Uh, if you want to uh, increase the red one, say, to one and a half minutes, you tap and hold this. And you see, now it's set. And these values get saved, obviously, on, on your preferences. Um, uh, but that, that's basically the, the main functionality. It's very basic. Um, I could have made uh, more presets than that, but first I want to see how this app is going. So I'm also going to uh, offer it as, as free when it gets approved. There's one more thing that I want to show you besides the LED numbers. That is, uh, this uh, app also uses DT about view controller. Um, you can see, uh, I'm, I can switch here just by tapping the eye. And this is a table view that gets uh, created by um, uh, an XML file, basically. And you have the uh, things like usage instructions, which is a, a local HTML file, which explains how to do everything. Uh, you have support where you can uh, send in a feature request, fills in the uh, version and the name automatically. Uh, you can review it in iTunes if you're on a device. And for social, uh, you can, uh, for example, follow me on Twitter and go to the website. And down here below, uh, you actually see uh, icons for all my apps and the ones that are uh, already installed, like in this case, speaker clock, are not active. The other ones you can tap uh, and and go there. Basically, it get, gives you um, directly to the App Store. Uh, and that's it for my demonstration of Speaker Clock. Uh, you will be seeing it uh, as soon as Apple uh, approves it. Bye bye.